Now you're gonna ask, who is the Don of NXT? Are you serious? You're, you're gonna ask me this question. Are you, are you insane? You should know who is Tony D'Angelo. No, it's not Angelo, it's Tony D'Angelo. Dude, the dude is a legend. I have already talked about him. Uh, I knew that he's gonna be special. At the moment he stepped foot at the NXT doors. This was back in the day, this was black and gold era. He was nobody, but now I, oh my goodness. I talked this last week. He just inserted himself into the match between Ilya and Carmelo. In the match between Tony and Carmelo, he played the music of Trick Williams, distracted Carmelo and got 1v1 match versus Ilya Dragunov at Stand the Deliver. And this is not the thing I want to talk about. I really want to talk about, you know what, we had a segment on the latest episode of NXT where Ilya goes to the restaurant of Tony D and basically Tony D kidnaps Ilya Dragunov <laughs> and brings him to the infamous bridge. The bridge that we have seen so many people disappear, right? But Ilya didn't disappear and it was so cool, man. I just really like the vibe of Tony D'Angelo. He is not really an Italian when we all know that, but he's playing it really well. He got the aura and it is amazing. I love Tony D as an NXT tag team champ and I love him without championship. And can we talk about the fact that he's probably going to lose against Ilya? But it's gonna be hell a match, man. It's gonna be hell a match. Can we, can we all agree about this? I want you guys in the comment to say I agree with you, Angelo, not Tony D'Angelo. Angelo without D, you know, Angelo. You know my name, right? Yeah, man. So hyped about the character of Tony D. So hyped about Ilya Dragon. So hyped about this match and. I'm really curious, even if he loses, even if he wins, maybe the character will evolve in some way. And I'm really curious to see what is the direction where the character will go. We have seen that the family has a new member in uh, Crucifino, I think is his name. And I'm really curious if they're going to push that narrative for another three, six months or Tony D and the family will go to SmackDown or Raw or whatever. But I'm really curious to see where, where is the direction. Maybe one day we're going to see Tony D'Angelo with a championship. I'm not sure. Or maybe he's going to win at Stand and Deliver with some help, you know, because he's having so many connections and probably they're going to play some music in the back or going to do some other shenanigans and... I don't know, man. I just love Tony D'Angelo. He's such a character, such a cool dude. I can't wait. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bam! And I'm gonna see you next time. Peace.